Hi everyone, so thank you for joining me today to know more about my project in virtual reality. So I start first with a small introduction and then I'll show you an overview of one of the modules I created. So here we go. Walking through galaxies, discovering new places around the world in less than a second, or reaching for the microscopic things in our world. All these things are now possible with virtual reality. Teaching parasitology can also be added to this list, as most microorganisms are invisible to the naked eye and or unsafe to manipulate in underground, lab underground laboratories. In 1968, Ivan Sutherland created the first head mountain display. As you can see on the right, just here, it wasn't really convenient, but it did render images from the viewers to change the code. Since then, a lot of progress has been made in this field, especially in movement tracking and 3D visualization. And now we have super efficient and powerful headset as the Oculus Quest, which I'm wearing just on the left. With the commercialization of VR-specific products and software, VR is now used in many different fields and teaching is one of them as it can be used to enhance students' engagement. Indeed, humans are, are hardwired to enjoy games, so entering game element into products and services might be the next generation method for students' engagement. So that's where the challenge of my project is. It's creating an interactive VR module about human parasitic disease for bi micro microbiology students, and not only for one parasite, but for seven different ones. With this module, students can consolidate the knowledge they have gained from lectures and laboratory classes. If you want to try it, here is what you'll experience, and here's what you'll see in the next small video. After investigating the symptoms of patient, you will execute four different diagnosis tests, then conclude a disease diagnostic, diagnostic and prescribe an appropriate medical treatment while learning about antiparasitic drug resistance. The good thing about this module is that it lets you physically run some tests, taking your hand through the representation of cells and parasites as you can see in the middle picture. In this way, it adds a lot to the standard curriculum. I also designed a shorter version of the module for science outreach activities. So this module can be used to engage discussions with the general public about the importance of infectious disease that affects millions of people worldwide, as well as promoting the research being conducted in this field. Due to the health situation, I can't let you try it, but I'm gonna show you a small video of what the experience looks like. Are you ready? So let's go.
Congrats! You successfully completed the VR module. And that's it. Thanks for watching. So that was the small uh, video, the small module for outreach activity, like some small steps that are added for the complete module to use in academic and the university. So if you'd like to see more or to know a bit more about this project, don't hesitate to contact me on my on Twitter, on my account, or the one on the lab, or even Facebook and on the comments. Thank you.